I mean, one area about the uh, the spice project is this that uh, if you look at the uh, value of the uh, underground, uh, what do you call it, the underground exhibition center, you are getting a seven acre park for free. And that seven acre park has a value of at least 15 million ringgit. You are getting it for free, not to be used exclusively by the developer. So, you know, some one of the lines they, one of the lines they pointed out. For instance, that we are giving 16 hectares of land to the developer. That's a lie. It's not stated there in the agreement. Another lie is that, oh, it's 250 million. You talk about in terms of uh, cost expanded, yes. Yeah. But you also got to look at the, the opportunity cost to the developer. And when you they give a seven acre park to the <coughs> public, or we insist they give a second acre park to the public that is worth at least 15 million, you must add it in. Mm. If they don't understand that, then that's why I said I do not want to respond to their lies. It is a, it is it is a waste of time. Read the agreement. If you have anything to hide, you know I made it public. You know when we make the agreements public, it is for five days. They claim that, oh, why only one hour, why only a short time? You can come back again. You, you wait for the next group to, to look at it. You always come back the next day. You can always come back the third day. And we don't restrict it for a certain period. So why lie on this type of thing? That's why I said we are tired of responding to these lies. We will not respond. Look at the agreement. It is all an open book. Uh, at the same time, when you criticize, we want to ask you, does Barisan National makes these agreements public? The IPP agreements, are they, is it made public? Are all these agreements made public? So you criticize, you, you criticize us for doing something that you do not do. So I said I do not want to, uh, to uh, uh, engage in lies or to uh, go for personal name calling because I think it is a, it is a waste of time. I think we should uh, focus on the basic building blocks that is crucial for Penang success. Number one, as I said just now in my speech, international city needs to you know, international standards and international benchmarks. We all know that we need a exhibition center. Price is subterranean. The International Convention and Exhibition Center. Now this is a unique project where you can, as I said, uh, uh, make Penang a more attractive tourist destination, especially in months. Meetings, incentive, conventions, and exhibitions. To so, I say, get more tourists to come to Penang, and of course, it is. You also help uh, to project Penang as an international city and also intelligent city. When we have these facilities, the, the, the best and brightest people who want to come to Penang. You look at all the top cities in the world, the, the best, the most livable city in the world is now Melbourne. Now Melbourne. Do they have a convention center? Do they have an exhibition? Sorry. Does Melbourne has an exhibition center? This is not a convention center, it's an exhibition center. Does Melbourne has an exhibition center? Learn from the best. We, are, we don't have the, the, the signs of uh, Melbourne, but we try to provide at least some of these facilities. And one issue that I did not mention just now, because we are dealing with uh, uh, investors with, with a portfolio of 100 billion US dollars. You know that we are going to build affordable housing that is of the highest standards over a 200 acre piece of land I think that has never been attempted before which allows I think the people of Penang to live in dignity so we hope to as I said to uh, review this over the next few months all these projects that we are planning we are very hard to work, we are working very hard to make this happen an international city that belongs to everyone and also an intelligent city only when you are international can you uh, engage and can you attract intelligent people to come to Penang.
and that is, as I said, the basic building blocks for our future success and prosperity.